What's going on guys? Just got out of the shower, that's why my hair is a little wet. But it is 12 o'clock at night. I've changed my schedule up to where I stay up to like 3.30 or 4 in the morning. And simply the reason, the only reason I do it is because from like 12 to 3 or 3.30, I am extremely uh, focused and heads down. It's just easier to get stuff done in that time. Given that, though, I haven't been waking up until like 11, 30, 12 because I still need to get seven hours of sleep. I tried going off like six, six and a half, and I just felt that my workouts were, were tanking pretty bad. Like I was just tired after, you know, a half hour. So it's, you know, it's not that I'm not still getting a full day of work in. It just feels a little bit different. So, you know, it's 12, and like I said, I still have three hours that I'll be awake three and a half hours, so I'm gonna eat my bedtime snack, and I'll probably drink a casein shake as well. Um, some other updates before I make that. The merchandise, so hoodies and shirts, the new stuff with the WJF is now available on the website, or not my website, but my online clothing website, which you can find below. They are making some updates to the site that I don't particularly care for, so I'm looking for a new uh, merchandise producer or wholesaler that can help me out. Um, I've sent a couple emails out, we'll see if they come back, but right now I gotta work with what I have to work with, so you know, I'm just dealing with it. But it's not terrible, the clothing's still good, it's still out there, so check it out. And also, my fitness coaching and meal planning service offering is now available as well. So if you want a custom seven day meal plan, Click the link in the description, check it out, or if you want, you know, let's say a macro assessment, you want to uh, figure out exactly what you should be eating uh, to lose weight, to gain weight, to gain muscle, you want to know what workouts to do, you want weekly check-ins, etc., etc. Awesomeness. There's a bunch of good stuff in the fitness coaching offering, so check out that link as well, and I look forward to working with you guys. But now, that's a lot of talking, and it's time for the bedtime <laughs> Now, if you watched my last video, which was the weekly meal prep, where I said, you know, I have no idea what I'm gonna do with the pineapple, I found something to do with the pineapple. And it's in my bedtime snack. Move this. And that's the bedtime snack, so I used half a cup to three quarter cup of 2% cottage cheese, half a cup, three quarter cup of 4% cottage cheese. And the only reason I do that mixture, and I don't just do you know 2% or I just don't do 4%, is because 2% is obviously a little bit lower in fat. So I give myself you know a reduced fat one and then a whole fat one because I think they taste good together. So that's the only reason I do that. And then some pineapples. But you know, let's say you're trying to go to bed in the next hour. That's probably not the best meal to eat because that pineapple has a lot of sugar and carbs and that will keep you up. So most likely gonna give you some energy, which is fine because like I said, I still have plenty of work to do tonight and I'll be up for another three, three and a half hours. So yeah, long night ahead. All right guys, I need to talk quietly so I don't wake Alex up. I'm not gonna talk that quiet, but I can't yell because he's sleeping. I'm gonna take my casein shake right now and I'm just gonna take it with like eight to ten ounces of water and then it's like 2 15 2 30 ish right now so I'll still be up for like another 45 minutes to an hour and then I'll go to bed and I'll wake up at like 10 45 11 11 15 something like that before I go to bed though I did want to say if you purchased any water jug fitness gear or if like you have a transformation that maybe you followed some of my meal plans whatever the case may be if you take pictures make sure to hashtag that water jug fitness because I want to see it or you could just email it to me or send it to me however because I want to share those types of things I want to let other people know or you know see that you're supporting water jug fitness and I support people who support water jug fitness so please do that <sighs> before I go to bed also I wind down at night by watching some it's always sunny in Philadelphia I 
I love that show, so it just helps me like wind down because I've already seen it, so you know, I watch like one episode and it helps me fall asleep. It's weird. I don't know why, but you know, since the last video I was telling you guys stuff about me, I thought I would just tell you more. So that helps me wind down. Also, my buddy thinks this is weird. Alex thinks this is weird, but I always sleep with a fan on. I don't have it on right now because it would be annoying for you guys to hear it. But yeah, I always sleep with the fan. I like the white noise. I think it's honestly because at home, or you know where I'm from, Toledo area, Defiance, we lived by a highway. So instead of like hearing the cars go by and the freaking you know semis locking up their tires and stuff. I don't know. You you hear weird stuff on the highways. <laughs> um, I would have the fan on, and it would just help me sleep. So, again, just more stuff about me. I think I'm I'm tired, so I'm just like rambling on, telling you guys stuff. So I'm gonna stop doing that before I tell you something that I don't or shouldn't tell you. Yeah, but I'm gonna go to bed, and I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning, everyone. It's time for some breakfast. It is like 11 15 11 30 which is not really breakfast but it's my breakfast because like i said i'm staying up till like four i stayed up till four four fifteen last night and then you know wake up at 11 15 11 30 i told you all this yesterday it's time for breakfast though so let's make it it was like the same concept You know what cinnamon spice does? Makes the duck seem nice. Nice. Uh, Clearly. Did yeah, you did. <laughs> Just an average morning here. Just normal. So there's the breakfast. I did three eggs and then I have one packet of apple cinnamon and two packets of cinnamon spice oatmeal. I'm gonna get some work done. I'm gonna lift today. I'm about to eat some lunch real quick. And here's what I have. So I have the six ounces of salmon with the jasmine rice and some broccoli. And I just threw that in the microwave for three minutes, two and a half, three minutes, and it's done. The salmon was a really good like change up this week. Um, if you guys eat fish, it usually goes down and it sits, you know, it doesn't sit heavy on your stomach and it's really easy to eat. So that's why I like either doing tilapia or fish, but um, not all the time either. So just mix it up. I'm gonna eat this, then I'm gonna go to Starbucks, get some work done, and then I'm gonna work out. I'm gonna do a leg workout with somebody, most likely, which you may or may not see. I don't know if I'll introduce him yet, but stick around. Going to Starbucks, that's what I'm doing. Made it. This place is packed though. So I just tried to do a Facebook Live video. First one failed miserably. I was recording it not realizing that there was no audio, and no one was telling me that there wasn't any audio, so I just kept talking, and obviously, you know, I was just talking like that, and people were just watching it and liking it, and I'm like, why would you not tell me? But then I recorded a second video, I don't know what's going on with the iPhone, but I had to actually plug in headphones to get it to work. So I hope that's not gonna be the case. I'll probably do some research tonight on it, but if you wanna follow me on Facebook, so you can follow my live videos that I'm gonna start doing, more and more, I'll put a link in the description, so follow me on Facebook, friend me, I'll friend you back, and you can watch my live videos. But, I'm about to go to the gym, I was gonna make a smoothie, but I ran out of time, I need to get there, so I'm gonna have some Fruit Loops, and I'll probably just eat a banana, and, whoa, 
I'll grab a protein shake as well. Now there's a reason I always pour the milk in first. I hate soggy cereal. So like I'm gonna eat this as fast as possible. One, because I'm running late, and two, if it gets soggy, I just don't like to eat it. I made a banana, protein shake, but I don't have much more time to record because I had like 10 minutes to get to the gym. So I need to eat this and eat more. I'll bring it back when I get to the gym. What's going on guys? As I stated earlier, I was gonna work out with someone. I'm working out with Carissa today. Uh, we hit some legs. We are training some legs. So this is my set of squats. Um, I worked up to it, but I did four sets of seven reps, and then I did the monster set again, where you know I'll pull off uh, two plates or a plate off each side, hit 10 to 12 more reps, and then pull off the last plate and hit an additional uh, 12 to 15 reps. And then here she's doing the same thing, just with a different weight. And again, guys, I'll put all the uh, workouts or all the exercises in the description with the sets and reps so you can check that out. And then I went on to some leg extensions, four sets of 10 to 12 reps with a superset of these walking lunges. But you, as you take a step, you kick back the other leg. I'm not sure if you guys have ever done these. If you haven't, they will be difficult. They're gonna throw you off balance a little bit, but they work. And that's really all I have for this commentary. So all the exercises and reps and stuff are in the description. So check that out. That was a good workout. I got my post-workout <laughs> shake here. Almost drank it already. It's just like, I just dump my BCAs in there. I don't care that it's, you know, watermelon flavor with vanilla. I just drink it. But I'll do anywhere from like 10 to 12 ounces of water uh, with one scoop away and five grams of Creatine. So I'm out of dextrose, which is why I've been snacking on like, it's not good, but I've been snacking on like Fruit Loops and stuff because sugar and carbs, I just need to order more dextrose. Um, I'm going to drink this and then in like a half hour, 45 minutes, 45 minutes, I'm going to heat up my post-workout meal. And I'm also probably still going to have a smoothie tonight because I didn't have one yet. So and I need to get my calories up. You know, I didn't think this was going to be a full day of eating video, but that's what it looks like it's going to be as well. Time for the post-workout meal. Excuse the mess. This is probably the messiest it's been in this kitchen you know, in a while, so just ignore it for right now. But for my post-workout meal, I have, uh, I have eight ounces of chicken, a little over a cup of rice, and then a little over a cup of broccoli. And I'm just going to heat it up for three minutes. That's it. <clears throat> and I'm gonna eat this. I am working on a couple meal plans because I'm getting more and more in. And like I said, they are live now. But you know, if people emailed me, I, I took it on, I did some for them. But officially, when this video launches, they will be launched as well. So there you go. If you want a custom meal plan or fitness coaching, hit me up. I'd be happy to help out. Also, if you're not following me on Snapchat, make sure to do that as well. Water Drip Fitness on Snapchat, right here. I try to post more. I told you about the Facebook Live stuff, so follow me there. Instagram, Water Drip Fitness, follow me there. I gotta plug all these things because I want you guys to follow and you know share your meal plans with me, share your progress so that I can also then share it out. That's what this is. It's a community of people trying to help other people. That's what we need to do. So this isn't the last meal. Well, it might be the last meal. I don't know. I gotta move my brownies that Alex is going to eat in his little thing. I'm gonna make a smoothie. Cut my head. I'm gonna make a smoothie real quick. We're watching what? How to Be Single. What are you just smiling for? You just come in smiling. I got my basic white girl outfit on. Nice. Stay at home sweatpants. And... Nice. Also, it's really cool. Alex, I finally talked him into letting me. Well, one, I'm gonna cook for him and prep his meals which he'll pay for, obviously. But then, at a discount. But two, he's gonna also let me figure his macros. 
So he's gonna go from being little tiny Tim to just being a fucking brick shit house. Cheers to that. <laughs> <laughs> While I eat a brownie. Okay, so you're so good. You're so fat. But I told him, I was like, oh, I'm gonna have to make your macros different than mine. He's like, how so? I said, we're gonna cut your carbs a little lower because he does these things. He treats himself a lot. So that thing just kind of happens in my life. Yeah, so he did cut his carbs a little lower. There's the smoothie. It's pretty thick. I'll probably need to use this spoon to eat it, but that's it's fine. It's fine. It just tastes good. We're gonna watch this movie, and then I'll probably work some more. All right, I'm probably just gonna wrap up the video now. I'm about to take a shower. I'll put the macros or the total calories in the description so you can check it out. I'm probably gonna wake up early though instead of staying up late tonight. So I just switched the schedule around. And yeah, that's all I have. So let me know what you guys thought of the video. Feedback is always helpful. And please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos like this. And thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed.